G'day yeah, mate. Well today I'm going to make a log holder or pole holder. So when you cut firewood, you cut rounds up like this. I've got a, um, the bloke who owns this property, I explained to him what I wanted to do. Um, he hasn't seen it yet, but he did say um, I need to do something first. Now we're, I worked this out before. When you sit by yourself, it's hard to do things. But the other guy where I was working, he's got uh, logs with knobs and branches, just bits and pieces hanging everywhere. They don't roll once you put them down. But here he's got a lot of stress stuff. So the owner said to me, um, cut some grooves in them, a V. That way when he puts the log on top, it won't roll and, and fall so he can um, set me up with half a dozen of these. So the, the idea is if I cut right, then cut left cut right and balance it up like a seesaw and that way he can set up as many of these I cut for him um, that keeps me clean out of the dirt and all the rest of the cut and we can all pick up the crap all the logs after we've done the cutting so I'll see how she goes see if we can do it not exactly sure how hard it's going to be cut it's not with the grain so I guess the grain sort of a funny angle so I'll do a 45 degree um, just to feed it so there we go Okay, I'm getting more used to doing it now. Um, the first one you saw was my first time I cut one. So that's about the right depth, I think, in that there was... I want, you might be doing bobcat, might be excavator. Excavator is what you want if you want one. So that's the first one there. Let's put it over there. But you lay a stick on top of that, your log, and it will roll. So I can cut this when he has time to load them up. So that's free. I'll do it probably half a dozen. Anyway. When I do um, get them loaded up, I'll do a video of him um, hooking them all up so you can see what they look like and why. It's good, very good. Try and film this from a different angle. Get a bunch of lead. Good view for the good viewing from the driver. Drive side. Do full control all that. Now it's in the V. I think. Yeah, it's in the V. So if there's not a roll in the Herbie. Beautiful. See how he uh nice big one. Same as I cut left first. Probably cut left twice. Get it right so 
now I'm set up one there um, more down here the first one second one third one so I'm set up all right guys I'm out of here well we're picking up the stick all along putting the log hole or stick holder see if this works Yep. It's all experimental. Right in the middle. Yep. Put in the holes and balance it. Hopefully it'll stay. Like that. Beautiful. Now I'm set up for the next torch to test. So that's about 22 inches side there. Let's measure that. So uh, yeah, 24 inches. That's a good size. So the idea is glue the low. Um, Look in front on the left hand side is more heavy than the right hand side. So I'll cut left, left, right, left, right. And keep doing it so it doesn't fall off. But that way I've got full control. I don't have to get the excavator around all the time. So it should be the, the sitting in the V. Sitting in the V like that. Beautiful. Perfect. Alright. Let's go for washing. 